Hello mo atu jamer ab ninga sa sa Hornbill TV. Pung pale rangkau 18 sal little stars higher secondary school laga student pra Nagaland Board of School Education pra conduct kriya laga HSS LC Science Stream day 94% pai kena top 4 day olai shi. Tai do Science Stream day my kero naga top ra se rangkau do HSLC 2019 day bi top 18 day olai shi aro Social Science day state topper hua karne. Mayang Nokcha Award for Excellence in Academics aro Chief Minister's Meritious Students Fellowship 2019 laga recipient bi ase. Hornbill TV pra tai logo de khota krigna se aro itu laga details sabo reporter azin logo de school education by HSLC aro HSS LC examination 2021 July 2018 the declaration are to be today on TV viewer, viewers can key a lot of stream la toppers can load the conversations can create the ideas the guy this year or a gym on it the naga topper in science stream or a girl topper in science stream pung ballet rank all out for the United States I do top four little star higher secondary school bro all I say to tell the quota crew low so firstly congratulations on the achievement thank you so much so like you know how what was your first reaction when you get to get to know that you were in the top list there were mixed reactions we when we got the list of the toppers we first saw Oidu's name, okay. top one. Yeah, yeah. My mother was very happy and then we went a little down and saw my name. My mother was overjoyed. <laughs> I was in shock and yeah. my brother unaffected. Yeah, I think the excited, excitement was too much that she had to pour a little bit of water on her head. <laughs> yes, yeah. uh, I had, actually, I had told my parents not to expect too much. Mm -hmm. I had to keep their hopes low. Mm -hmm. I under promised and then maybe over delivered so they were happier they were yeah, more satisfied yeah, yeah yeah all right so uh, you know how did you prepare for the exams and and then we also get to know that you were in the top 18 in hslc examination that was in the year 2019 yes. so like and then you are a recipient of so many awards as well so how did you maintain that consistency when it comes to studies uh, it's uh, the we just have to study regularly. That is very important. Um, we don't have to study for very long hours every day. Just three to four hours mm -hmm. will be enough during regular days and increase it a bit during the exams. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we hear toppers say that they study for 10, 12 hours. I think uh, for most of us that is not possible. Five, six, seven hours, that will be enough. During all this, uh, in all this journey, in all this, uh, you know, achievements, who was your biggest support? God has been the greatest support. He has been so kind to our family. Mm -hmm. uh, all the achievements that I've uh, had, big or small, mm -hmm. are all His blessings. Mm -hmm. I want to thank my parents for their immense support. I extend my gratitude to our school authorities and my teachers as well for their dedication and hard work. So what in your opinion can be the reason why Nagas doesn't, uh, you know, like, be in the top list. We Nagas, I think uh, we are less determined than the uh, others. Others, they are so hardworking and we Nagas are lacking in that, mm. in that sense, yeah. Okay, so, uh, you know, last year it was all about pandemic. The, the, it was all locked. The school was dismissed. So how did you deal with online classes as well? And did you face any challenges in the process? Yes, I got, uh, sometimes I got distracted, uh, demotivated also. Since we are not uh, coming to school, uh, we don't see our teachers in person. So, yes, but the teachers worked really hard. We, uh, we our online classes uh, started way early, just after the pandemic started, the lockdown. So uh, our school made sure that we were all uh, being taught very well mm -hmm. even during the lockdown how about uh, online exams it was like first of its kind right so how did you deal with it yes online exams maybe it's like uh, just like the offline exams for some of us mm -hmm. those who those who study well and give honestly wi uh, without any unfair means it's like same like the offline exams mm -hmm. for us but uh, most of them wouldn't be um, honest during those exams and that might be unfair to the ones who have uh, really worked hard and gave their best during those exams. You know, do you have any message for the people out there who are like your juniors or your brothers and sisters who are aspiring to be one like you? 
Yes, uh, being the female state topper and the Naga topper, I feel really honored. And if uh, seeing these achievements, my the juniors, uh, brothers and sisters, if uh, they get inspired and inspired to work harder and achieve much more than that, I'll be very happy. And yeah, there are many. We get many advices from people on how to succeed. But I think the most imp uh, two most important are uh, hard work and prayer. We need to put in uh, a lot of effort to achieve whatever we want in life. But without uh, God's blessings, uh, it it's all meaningless. Work hard, but also keep praying that God will bless you. And then, uh, what does the future looks like? Um, yes, I've uh, applied, registered for both uh, entrance exams for engineering and medical. I will be appearing both, but then it's all in God's hand. He will lead the way. He will open up the way to the career which is best suited for me. Well, we wish the best for that. And then congratulations once again. Thank and you so much. Thank you so much for joining in our conversations today. Thank you.